introduce the hero at first. I'm excited to introduce the hero at first, uh, since this is about war. I've been fighting since I joined the society, and honestly, there's been a North Shield since I joined the society. Well, my first event was North Shield's first coronet tourney. Wow. Yeah. War is a special time for fighter because war is the one time that you're not fighting for yourself, you're not fighting for your inspiration, you're fighting for your people. This is the tabard of the first printing that I wore at Benson 25. Now, a tabard is not a 13th century garment at all. So long ago, this has been replaced with something else. Um, but it's not done in its days of service. So that is what I've written there. In darkened room, the old one takes his rest. With its folded cloaks and blankets, now he sleeps. In ancient days, he met the warrior's test. Now honored place at home, he proudly keeps. His age is clear, his body thin and worn. The scars of countless fights his skin does wear. In many places deeply rent and torn, yet ever nursed to health with skill and care. The flower of youth shows no more in his face. The sable dull marred the gold. A younger kinsman serves now in his place, long surcut new, replacing tabard old. But long ago, when griffins first took wing, his breast was filled by brave men new to war, who marched to serve their newborn prince and king. His brothers wrapped the chests of many score, and eager came to battle with their lord. Standing close with veterans met the foe, enduring stab of spear and cut of sword, repaying well with steel each suffered blow. Their bodies jostled hard in battle press from bravely crashing headlong to the fray. So what its scars this noble warrior's dress, and memories and triumphs of its day. But now it waits to clothe a youth again, who by his deeds will fill it fresh with glory, who will thrill to couch among the griffin kin, and add his chapter to its hollow story. 